Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and this is the legendary Iron Man Lone Wolf run where we're trying to beat the game on the highest difficulty with a single soldier permission. It is do or die time. We are being attacked uh, and our adventure has been shut down. This mission here cannot be fielded with only a single soldier so I needed to in minimum uh, field two which still is not enough. The whole mission here is gonna go pretty much southwards. I am very much looking forward for the defense matrix, but I am I have little confidence that that will make it so much more easy. We are fighting against the Chosen, probably 30 enemies, and if we fail to uh, to... oh my gosh Oh my gosh, if we fail to do this mission, it is game over. So this here is really the last chance that we will get. I am not at all in favor of the chrysalids. Okay, so as I was saying, if we're failing this mission, the whole run will be over. This is one out of two loss conditions. Basically losing the Avenger or losing the Avatar project. So the Assassin has, let's go through that, Beastmaster, which means she can summon savage allies. It could be Chrysalids, that could be Faceless Ones, it could be Berserkers. Nasty, very nasty. She's immune to explosions, which is bad because our uh, claymore mine from the Reaper will not work. Maybe to shred her, but that's about it. And she can see concealed units, which sucks as well for the Reaper. Problem is, we don't have a Templar, and another problem is we are not really close to her. Our best bet would be to somewhat lure her into a position where we can spot her out, get rid of her, uh, uh, get rid of her cover, and maybe kill her. Let's start with the chrysalids. I'd like to finish them during this round, if possible. Well, 75%. Should be a hit. Very nice. All right, every one of them is softened up. Good. We got untouchable and can simply stay here for now. Fortunately, the chrysalid dodged our blade storm. But we should be able to take him down. Luckily, Roby has a medkit, so he would be immune to their poison. There will be no you know what? Let Roby handle this. Yes, sir. 
This here gives him untouchable. We put him into a position that the Chosen likely is going to to go after, if he's just standing here. Chosen usually takes the di most direct pass. She spawned here, will run all the way down here, she always does that, and take the first enemy that she that she will find. This Chosen is not immune to Overwatch, so we're doing exactly that. We just need to spot her out, that's all. This here is a good position because we can see this, this, all of this here. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, ooh. I do have an idea. I, I'm not sure why exactly we couldn't see her beforehand. I don't know why we couldn't see her beforehand. But let's use this shrapnel here. This should get rid of the stone. And it nicely shreds her. And now... We're firing into an, a position without cover. So we play our cards halfway okay. So hitting every second shot, we should inflict a lot of damage. Nice. There's the crit. 12. Keep it going. Come on. Ooh, come on. Oh, very good. I don't want to go into the open and then miss a shot. That would suck. Let's try the 50-50. Good enough. Wow. Okay. Ooh, that was an incredibly good start. of that chosen left i've got a feeling we haven't seen the last of them still at least we ruined their plans today that was damn close lucky us that we spotted her out i mean she's predictable because she always just goes straight ahead and she can only spot out invisible units like basically when when they are not in cover. Since we were in cover, everything was fine. Let's try to pull this pack over here. Stun Lancer down. Somehow we can't see the mech. 
So we gotta take shots at the second best target. Let's hit the mech, please. Thank you. Moving into full cover. Implaceable. We could go go in further, but I don't know. Normally there are more packs here. We do have untouchable at the moment, so I'm not worried about taking a shot. Double movement from him. The good part about the towers is they usually take very good care of, of the environment. So taking a couple of shots at them normally leaves um, the, the trees completely destroyed. Good, moving in, moving back, Roby does some hit and run. Alright, got two packs over here. I think this one here is an interesting pack. Okay, very, very well. They have moved in position and some of them have taken really, really bad cover. Which we are going to massively abuse. There we go. Killing the mutants first. See in the background, uh, some of the trees already went down. Nice. Moving a bit more into safety. Don't want to be spotted out. All right, Roby, finish him. Very nice. Good job, buddy. You may say whatever you want, but the defense matrix is the single best invention ever. There we go. Let's hit him. Nice. Good trigger the next pack. Oh, pack of four.
Let's start hitting the mech first. Mech is almost down. I think we can finish the mech a hundred percent. So yeah, we can ignore the mech for now. Good. Purifier down. Hmm. You know what? Let's hit two birds with one stone. The shield bearer. We didn't have a second shot. I was about to say the shield bearer could have been easily shredded if we're uh, if we're exploding the car, but unfortunately, I only had one tower shot left. Well, those two are now standing right next to the card, which means we can still do that. And it serves a good purpose because we got to get rid of uh, those cards anyways. Since he has six hit points left, we gotta make sure that he dies. Nice, and we unlocked a promotion, major rank for our Reaper. That's good, because we can get a couple of skills that are super helpful. We need to deal with the gun now, with that is causing a lot of trouble. Almost there. Once we are at the gun, we can probably use our our ranged um, defense metrics to kill it. Okay, remote starting. Sizable amount of damage. I don't know where we are though. And now we can deal some extra damage. Thirty two points of damage. Nothing is going to survive that.
Nice. Good. I think we made a really solid progress. Now only two more two more cars are missing. Look at that. A single trooper runs into our direction in the hopes of reaching us. Damned sustenance, as always. Good, we're overwatching. I don't want uh, the priest to come out of uh, its sustenance and then mind control us immediately. He can start move closer, but he needs to use his movement action. Or alternatively, do nothing and just stand there. In which case we're going to take shots, lots of shots. There we go. Priest done. The true VIP of uh, this, uh, this mission here is our defense matrix. Codices, interesting. Wow, fifteen percent shot, and we're just hitting it, nailing it like a pro. Okay, so here we go. Eh, I don't want to trigger it by thinking about it. Let's just let it be. Well, now we can give it a try. Okay, a couple of codices. Even though the overall chances to hit them are low, we have a lot of shots, so we will hit sooner or later. There we go. Nice little crit. Yep, take away the cover, just like that. It is still in full cover, by the way. Moving a bit closer. And let's see what the Codex is going to do. I'm not even sure if it knows where we are. Wow. 
hot into full cover. Do your effing psionic bomb. Finally, it's without cover. There we go. All right, uh, we're missing very high percent sh uh, shots. That's the third one in a row. Good, we do have untouchable, so we should be fine. They are cowards. Moving as ordered. And this here might be the mission. Not. Oh my gosh, we're still fighting against someone. Get back in there. Ready to engage. Oh, I do have an idea. The last um, car is still there. I go where you tell me. There we go. That was a close call, guys. But it's still not enough. There is, There are enemy forces left over. Some enemy pack is still there, and I bet you it's probably far, far behind. Whew, that's a tough one. Yeah, zero percent. That's a problem. We can't help them. I don't want to fight that deep, deep down there. Volk says I am to obey. Do we have anything else to explode? Only that, okay. Shouldn't underestimate it. The defense metrics does the, mo uh, the majority of our work in. We're low on cooldowns and really don't have any firepower support over here. Come get 
some. Difficult pack to engage. We need to be really careful here. They are close to the car. makes it tempting because we can remote start the car from here. Always observe your surroundings. Thirty percent is better than zero percent. Okay, so the codex is gone. Prime question now is, what is the rest doing? I think we can't hit 0% shots. There's an astronomical small chance so that it is not just flat out 0%. Yeah. I wish we could pull them closer, but we're at minus 3%. You might find it ridiculous why I am taking 5% shots, but please believe me. This here is way more difficult than it looks. If they are not moving in, we're having a problem. That's a much better position. Thirteen percent, I can work with thirteen percent. to be in rocket range and I know exactly how the heavy mech is going to use its rockets even on a really 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 long distance.
We might not be hitting a lot, but 10% means per round of shots, or 13% means per round of shots that we're taking, there is on average one hit. We're also getting rid of all of the cover. Most of it at least. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Don't get spotted out. Wow. Just shouldn't have reloaded. I totally forgot that she had the debuff. Continuing with the mech. I know 10% is not a lot. But we're getting there eventually. anyone almost 20% that's phenomenal no we're not going to take a shot If it would have one hit point less, we could finish it, but it doesn't. So let's not try our luck. Okay, the neck is moving closer and that is good. Finally. Vault says I am to obey. Okay, let's hope they're coming closer. Really solid chances to hit, hit them now. There we go. And that's it, guys. After 40 minutes of blood and sweat, we killed 30 enemies and defended successfully. Wow, that was intense. That was intense. The one time that I reloaded, I, f I figured that we might lose the Reaper. That would have been so bad. It's tempting, you see, that she would need to reload, and then you're triggering 
basically her phobia. Okay, major rank. We definitely wanted to get an additional claymore. Banish is also really good. But Shredder might be even better for now. We were missing it desperately against the Chosen. And look at that. Wonderful. Lots of corpses, berserkers, mutants, a lot of wrecks, codex brains. Finally, all the good stuff that we didn't have. So once we're done with the adaptive um, combat sims here, we can then even go for mutant autopsy and for powered armor afterwards. Maybe we're even skipping the medium, um, the medium powered armor. By the way, that's a good question. Could we? No, we don't have enough trooper corpses. F you. Nice, look at that. Got the promotion. Unfortunately, he wasn't available during the actual mission. So we could use we could use a scientist. Yeah, but we need to reduce the avatar pro, uh, project that has highest priority. So plus it would be another promotion. Ghost for him, and the spokesman took a big risk getting inside. I like Iconic Storm. For me to believe he's loyal to our cause. There may still be a few skeptics in the movement, but we're going to get all of the other abilities, anyways. Can they already train the next bond level? No, they can't. Okay, so since he's a colonel already, I'm not sure if it would be a better idea. Wow, Roby is gone for 16 days. Are you kidding me? Okay, this here is eight days. How long until month end? I think increasing our faction, uh, influence with affection would be good as well. That's mobility plus the skirmishers have really good um, resistance orders. Health plus one is also good. That's a fast one even. Six days plus one health. I think we're going to do that and afterwards reduce the avatar progress or who else could use a promotion I mean obviously we can put her in right Yeah, let's give her the promotion. We will begin the covert action immediately, Commander. It means we don't have someone 
uh, that could now take um, any mission. Yeah, and then a retaliation mission comes up. Anyways, that's going to happen in uh, the in the next video. For now, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the content and if you are ex as excited uh, as I am that we're still in this run, despite all of the hardships, then give it a thumbs up, guys. And I would like to see a comment about the um, about the Avenger defense mission. Thank you so much and have a great evening. Bye bye.